All right, and what we've got going for this week is, uh, well, five boats going. That's more than double what you've done before then. <laughs> yes, it is. Um, we had um, had two boats go, and then um, one time before George we had two boats go. So uh, this is a uh, uh, five is five is good. We look forward to five more next year. Five more next year? Maybe uh, maybe more than that. <laughs> I think once the word gets out, you were going to have a couple of beaches crowded with Hobie cats. I think so too, and I have visions of that too. I have visions of all these Hobie cats racing across the street, and I get really excited. I think it's a wonderful sport. Making a line and blocking cruise ship traffic. Exactly. They can <laughs> they can get out our way for a change. <laughs> I think uh, I'm really excited to have, have been a part of this or to take part in this and I think that uh, for over 50 years makes this a pretty special event. It's absolutely special. A lot of people are looking to this event to uh, plan for their own future events and such like that. Now you and George have uh, also started uh, an organization for event for this for regatta planning as well. Extreme regattas? Yes. Uh, we have re extreme regattas, and uh, we plan a series of these kind of adventure trips uh, via Hobie Cat around the world. Boats. <laughs> well, yeah, you know, this one was a bit of a moving target. Um, you know, it, it took a while for for the various uh, uh, agencies that, that needed to be involved to kind of create a process. There just hasn't been a process in place. Well, you're the guys that did it. Now... If there were 15 beach cats or mono hulls or anything that might want to do this kind of event, would you be interested in participating in that and, uh, and you know, like working with uh, the presidents of the One Design organizations or whatnot to get them across? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, uh, we like doing this. We think it's a really, you know, it's a really cool experience to be involved in this kind of intercultural exchange. And I think it's meaningful, you know. I think that I think there's a lot of pent-up demand to go and sail in Cuba. It's such a beautiful place. Uh, we'd be happy. George and I would be happy to support that and work with and work with groups like that. Yeah, we have we have the experience. We've done this a bunch of times. Now we now we know the uh, we know how to move through the labyrinth of the of the permitting process, which is which can be frustrating and well, which is frustrating, but. Uh, you know, that can be, it will be. It is frustrating. Um, and, but we've, now, now that we've had this success, uh, the various regulatory powers that be know who we are. We have the relationships on this side of the Florida Straits as well as down in Havana. Um, yeah, we would really like to be involved if, if someone was interested in, in doing this. Yeah, bring it on, let's go. And you can look, you can look for uh, George or me at HavanaChallenge.com. <laughs> you heard it. He said, "Let's go." All right, Bob everybody. Uber. <laughs> <laughs> everybody in. All right. Well, thank you very much, and good luck with everything. And we'll see you out on the water tomorrow. Yeah, you sure will. Thanks, Jeff. Let's go sailing. All right. We're here with George Bellinger, the head honcho, the main guy in this organization here. Well, organization used loosely. I thought this was going to be a friendly interview. <laughs> Softball. <laughs> All right. How are things going for you so far here? Yeah, great. Uh, night before, we're looking forward to it. Looks like a beautiful day shaping up for tomorrow. God, I know I'm going to have a lot of fun just on the chase boat, even if I don't get to sail across the Gulf Stream. It's going to be bumpy. <laughs> we're going to see some waves out there bigger than the boats tomorrow, Jeff. What do you think? Uh, well, they're going to be about the size of the boats, yeah, probably that. Um, I'm just wondering how many people are going to be up to showing us their bruises on the other end. <laughs> you don't want to see mine. They're going to be in a bad spot. I'll be sitting on that bar most of the day. <laughs> I'm guessing we're going to get over there in less than 12 hours, maybe closer to 10. Yeah, that was about my estimate, too. I was thinking the 10-hour range, if anybody does it, below that they're in good shape anybody does it over that then you can kind of guess how many times they flip the boat on the way yeah well we got five boats if we get four of them to finish that probably pretty good <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna lose something I'm pretty sure about that but we got a tow boat and a crane boat and we're gonna pick up the pieces uh, on the way across
<laughs> as long as everybody gets over there for the rum party, we'll be in great shape, man, because we're just there to, you know, have fun and make friends, right? That's right. Uh, Reestablishing historical friendships, uh, community interests, Havana, Key West, been neighbors for a long, long time, sharing in a, a maritime tr tradition of cooperation and friendship. While we're in Cuba, we're going to race against the Olympic and national team guys over a new trophy we're referring to as the Friendship Cup. So we're going to uh, do one design out in front of the Moro Castles uh, along the Malacone in Old Town, Havana on Tuesday. But it's going to be a good time. It'll be a wild ride. Uh, follow along on HavanaChallenge.com. So, so we, we now announce the winners of the race. Entrega los premios George Bellinger, President del Comité de Regata de la Havana Challenge. Presenting the awards George Bellinger from the race committee. Impartación, tercer lugar, premio al tercer lugar. País Cuba, atleta Julio David Mesa Yosik y el neto Alan Chávez. Premio al segundo lugar, País Cuba, atletas Enrique Hernández Cabrera y Emanuel Vladimir Solás Díaz. Second place, from Cuba, Pedro Enrique Hernández Cabrera y Emanuel Vladimir Solás Díaz. <laughs> First place. País Cuba. Atletas Nino de la Guardia Anzó y Alejandro de la Guardia Pérez. From Cuba, Nino de la Guardia Anzó y Alejandro de la Guardia Pérez. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, tonight uh, we are proud to announce uh, the uh, Copa de Amistad. Hoy tenemos el orgullo de presentar la Copa de la Amistad. This will be a trophy that will stay here at the Hemingway Marina. Este será un trofeo que se quedará aquí en el, en el Club Náutico eh, Hemingway de Cuba. In the uh, Presenting the award tonight, I would like to present Daniel Gilleran. Daniel Gilleran, será el que presentará la copa esta noche? Please. Hi, everybody. Hola a todos. I just want to say a few things Solo quiero decir, uh, algunas cosas. about what the Friendship Cup represents acerca de lo que representa la, la Copa de la Amistad. A growing friendship between two people. La amistad que crece entre dos pueblos. The people of Key West and Havana. Los pueblos de Key West y de La Habana. With each passing year, I hope this friendship can grow. En el año este que transcurre, espero que nuestra amistad crezca. This cup is also a memorial of my younger brother. Esta copa también es en memoria a mi hermano más joven. Matthew Gilleran. Matthew Gilleran. A young man. Un joven. Who loved to sail. Que amaba navegar. And make friends everywhere he went. Y que hizo amigos a donde quiera que fue. Thank you all. Muchas gracias a todos. It was a great race. <laughs> fue una gran regata. Nos vemos en la vida que viene.
hace 48 horas. 48 hours ago. Dije algunas palabras. I said a few words. Que después muchos se acercaron a mí. Then, then after that, a lot of people came, uh, came to me. Y me dijeron que se habían emocionado. And told me that they were very deeply touched by what I said. Hoy. Today. También estamos muy emocionados. We are deeply touched. Si en aquel momento dije que nuestros corazones. If back then I said that our hearts. Estaban llenos de agradecimiento a todos ustedes. We'll feel with joy and gratitude to all of you. Por haber sido actores principalísimos. For being the leaders. En este acontecimiento histórico. In en this historical event. Es un acontecimiento histórico. This is a historical event. Que quedará para siempre en las páginas de la historia de la náutica recreativa de Cuba y Cayo Hueso. That will record it forever on the pages of the boating history between Key West and Cuba. Este es el principio del rompimiento del embargo. This is the beginning of, of, of bringing the embargo down. Porque basta, basta de dificultades y trabas. So let's stop obstacles. Para que cada día seamos más amigos y más felices. So let's be friends even more by day. Pero hoy tengo que decirle también But today I also have to say que nuestro corazón está aún más agradecido that our hearts are filled with gratitude porque lo que se hizo hoy frente al malecón because what we did today in front of Havana Malecón no solo va a ser un mensaje de amistad, de paz, de amor al mundo it's not only a message of friendship, peace and love to the world también va a ser un mensaje de amor al mar y a los deportes náuticos para la sociedad cubana It is also a message of love and respect for the sea for the Cuban society. Para que sepan quien tenga que saberlo. For everybody to know. Que aquí en Cuba. That here in Cuba. También habemos hombres y mujeres. There are also men and women. Que amamos el mar. That love the sea. Que amamos los deportes náuticos. That love boating sports. Y que amamos la amistad y el amor con la international boating community. And that we love the friendship with the international boating community. Hoy ha sido un maravilloso espectáculo lo que hemos brindado. We have given today a wonderful show. A todo el que pasó por el malecón. To everybody that was passing by the malecón. A todo el que estuvo en el malecón. Everybody that stopped by that went there. Y a todos los que van a ver la televisión cubana. And everybody that watched the TV. Gracias a nuestros dos queridísimos aliados. Thanks to uh, two of our dearest allies from the press, from the Cuban press. Que son los periodistas Ernesto y Guillermo. Ernesto and Guillermo. Que estuvieron hoy en el malecón, oh, oh. grabaron lo que hicimos hoy. That took the images of what we did today. Y que today. tuvimos la posibilidad de verlo right. hace unos minutos and atrás. And we have the, uh, the chance of, so of seeing a little clip a few minutes ago. Y que toda Cuba verá. And that the, uh, all Cuba will see. Gracias, muchas gracias. Thank you. Por habernos hecho felices en estos días. Happy. Y todo esto que hemos hecho. And everything we have done. Además tiene otro agradecimiento más. I I also want to thank. Es que con la acción de ustedes. Is because thanks to you, han contribuido a fortalecer a nuestro club náutico internacional Hemingway. To strengthen our Hemingway International Yacht Club of Cuba. Que después de 32 años, que después de 32 años sin existir un club náutico en Cuba, that after 32 years without the existence, of logramos fundarnos. Of a yacht club in Cuba, y como we dije hace 48 this, horas, and as I said 48 hours ago, hemos tenido que atravesar. Y seguimos atravesando mares tempestuosos. We have faced uh, high waves and winds, and strong winds. Pero con el amor y el espíritu que ustedes nos transmiten. But with the love and support that you give us. Hemos sabido seguir en el curso. We have managed to keep track. Y nuestra nave sigue. And our ship moves forward. Navegando. Sailing. Hay veces que hubo con avería. Sometimes we grow down. Hay veces que con agua en la centina. Sometimes we have water in it. Pero no nos vamos a rendir nunca. But we will never give up, ever.
All right, and our story is, we came up with a little bit of story on that earlier. We did, yeah. I mean, we hit this whale. Um, they were going, I think, probably about 35 knots. I think probably they were sailing, and they hit the whale. The Hobie <laughs> flipped three times in the air, and then the whales came back and helped to write it. It's more or less the story that's going around. Okay, okay, and that will work just fine until we put the video with it. Okay, they're great. The whales took the line in their teeth, and they helped write the boat. <laughs> that's what we're saying. Yep, that's our story. All right, thanks, Jenny.